In this video, I'm going to show you how to erase your Hornet Prey receiver and also pair your receiver to a transmitter. So here is our receiver. For this demonstration, I've wired this up to four LEDs to show the output status of the relays from the receiver. So to erase the Hornet Prey, take a magnet and place it on the receiver just to the left of the antenna base. Hold it there for about 10 seconds until you hear a short beep. After this beep, remove the magnet and you'll hear a long beep to confirm you have erased the receiver. Now I'm going to pair the inputs on my transmitter using this key fob to the outputs on the receiver. I can pair any of the inputs on the transmitter to any of the outputs on the receiver. But for this demonstration, I'm going to pair button one on the transmitter to output one on the receiver. To select output one on the receiver, you use your magnet placing it on the left of the base of the antenna only once and briefly, then remove it. Doing so, you should hear one beep. This beep tells me relay one is about to be paired. So I now can press the transmitter button of my choice. In this case, button one. I hear two short beeps showing confirmation from the receiver the two are now paired. When I operate button one, we can see it operates output one. I'll now pair button 2 to output relay 2. To do this, I place my magnet to the left of the base of the antenna briefly two times. And then I'll hear two beeps. This shows me output relay 2 is ready to be paired, meaning I can press a button to pair. In this case, button 2. And I can hear my two confirmation beeps telling me the relay is paired. Now I'm going to demonstrate pairing of two outputs to one button. In this case, output one and four to button one. I've already paired output one to button one, so I'm going to select output four by placing my magnet to the left of the base of the antenna four times. When I hear four beeps, I know output four is ready to pair. So I can press button one again and I have paired the output. As you can see, now pressing button one operates outputs one and four. You can pair any number of inputs to any number of outputs, up to a maximum of 30 pairings. To see more videos on our products, subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit www.rfsolutions.co.uk.